Alright guys, Camo Dude here. And uh, yes, this is a cemetery. But this is somewhat of a special cemetery. And uh, for all you history buffs out there, as soon as you see this tombstone, you'll know uh, what I'm who I'm talking about as far as history goes. This is the uh, Barrow, the Barrow uh, tombstone of uh, Clyde Barrow, and uh, Clyde being uh, Bonnie and Clyde. So this is his uh, gravesite here at Western Heights Cemetery in Dallas, Texas. So uh, <laughs> someone left some beer bottles here. I don't think they had Bud Light back then back when he was running around but uh, they did have these uh, there's some uh, shell casings here somebody left some shell casings looks like uh, I don't know what size they are but uh, I'm sure they don't uh, it's not the size of the the guns they used back then he was using the Tommy gun probably yep this is Clyde Barrels um, Gravesite here at Western Heights Cemetery in Dallas, Texas. And uh, yeah, so I didn't know there was access to his gravesite. So there is an access you can. Uh... As a matter of fact, uh, this is the whole uh, Barrow, Barrow uh, family here. Some more. Grave sites. I'm not sure who those were. Uh, yeah. So Bonnie, Bonnie is not buried here at this cemetery here. She was buried uh, at another cemetery in the Dallas area. Uh, I'm not sure which one it is, but. Clyde's buried here, and you know Dallas was uh, was where he was born at, uh, not far from let's see Singleton. On Singleton Avenue, there's a uh, a gas station. Uh, it's still it's still uh, the structure is still there with the gas station. I believe his dad probably ran the gas station, and. Uh, And that's where he grew up here in Dallas, I guess. Or, uh, not sure if he was born here, but uh, he was raised here, I guess. And there's a lot of shell casings here. Uh, 45, 45 shell casings. That's what that is, 45. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, guys, uh, yeah, I just thought I'd stop by here since I was on the way to the house and see. It didn't used to be a uh, place where the public can come to, really. It was locked up. The gates were locked up and everything, but uh, there is a way to come in here now for the public to walk in and check it out. So, yeah, Clyde Barrel's uh, uh, gravesite here at Western Heights Cemetery in Dallas, Texas. Uh... C, March 24th, 1909, May 23rd, 1934, Clyde of Bonnie and Clyde. Of course, uh, back then there probably wasn't uh, too many homes close to the cemetery here. Back when the cemetery was still, uh, you, there's no more burials going on in this cemetery. It's all filled up. <laughs> no occupancy here. Uh, let me pick a. 
get the front gate here. Christian Heights Cemetery. It's got a historical marker here. Said uh, located on part of the original William Coombs survey. Burials in the cemetery date to the 1850s, originally known as Trough. It was formerly dedicated in 1881 when land was set aside for a graveyard forever by Z.E. Coombs and W.R. Fisher. Pioneers interred here include W.R. Fisher, Z.E. Coombs, John and Rosina Lupo, Mary Ellen Cole Togo, and Heinrich and Anna Strzok. Also buried here are veterans of the Civil War and World Wars I and II. And of course, in Clyde and Buck Barrow. Trinity Oaks Church of Christ maintains a historic cemetery. Yeah, his brother is also buried here, Buck. Light and Buck. Yeah. Uh, let me go back there and see. If I see, I didn't see the, the Buck, uh, the Buck Barrel, because he was part of the game back in the day. I believe maybe that was his name Marvin I don't know the seeds 33 34 yeah I guess that was his name Marvin I guess Marvin was Buck. Maybe that's his nickname. All right, guys. Here's some Civil War Civil War veterans out here too. Wow! Look at this tombstone here. It's that, that is gone down to the ground it's sunk anyway guys I just thought I'd uh bring you out here for whoever has never seen the gravesite of Clyde Barrow of Bonnie and Clyde.